hi this is sage sunset and today i'll be guiding your pick a card reading for your career and money messages what is coming up in your career so you're going to divide the cards into three and then you're going to be choosing from one stack of cards to get your messages from now bear in mind you should choose from the card the stack of cards that just really resonate with your energy overall okay oh I see some messages coming out here already in career all right, we're not gonna use all of these but I'm just curious to see what they're saying I'm gonna keep these here Okay, so we're gonna shuffle here first. First, let me do this. Get my little shaking on. I need a career for the upcoming week. Hmm. I see Earth sign. Feel a bit of love here as well. Earth sign, Earth sign, and Sagittarius. Let's get started. What's coming up in the career? In our careers, in the week. The money for the life purpose. What's going on in our careers? In our viewers' careers here. And I'm separating this deck in three. And I'm gonna ask you now to choose one deck that resonates with your energy right now. Really breathe in and focus your energy on what it is and what deck you think most resonates with what is going on with you. Feel out that deck. We're gonna give you a few moments to really breathe in. <sighs> okay. Then you're gonna choose from my left to right, deck number one, deck number two, and deck number three here one best feels like it's calling to you <sighs> or you can choose your favorite number your lucky number one two three all right let's go for those that chose deck number one let us see what's going on or coming up in your career are you ready okay so we have the nine of cups over here Feel like there's a lot of emotion in what you do um hmm. you may be into therapist i feel like energy healing like reiki reiki energy healing physical therapist maybe doing with hydrotherapy all right so let's just see what's coming up in your career we have the three of cups <laughs> okay so there's a celebration there is something to celebrate. What do you do? Hmm. I feel like you do work with water, with healing. Maybe I feel wine. I know that there's cups here, but I do feel like you could be a wine connoisseur. You like maybe drinking. What do you do? Are you a bartender? But there's a celebration as if there's a party coming up, possibly in your honor. dined do you own a restaurant so the signs that are here water sign cancer pisces scorpio i also see earth sign taurus virgo a bit of capricorn 
somebody might want to celebrate with your promotion because you do so well at you're so good at what you do hmm Three of Cups, love, healing. I feel strong healing. It might be something that you worked on because it is a passion of yours, a natural gift that you have. And then you probably sell it, um, went to study to make it a profession. And it's working out in your favor. I feel you celebrate, you sharing to something, maybe a promotion. Let's see what's behind this card. I do not do reversals, so I'm taking it upright. I feel like you're balanced. You see, there's a lot of water present here. Emotions, entrepreneurship. So I feel you might help people to balance their emotions find balance to maybe breathe relax and align that could be your passion something that you're passionate about is actually helping people to find sturdiness balance you may lead from your heart as if your, your job is your heart you know what I mean your heart tells you what to create but there's a celebration coming up here you have a lot to still be thankful for you know that's what i'm seeing in your cards for your career coming up those of you who chose card number one okay a celebration a balance so this celebration might help you to put other things into place that you were dreaming of other goals might help you to set up shop maybe you want to open a shop online or something I feel it's beauty and aesthetics if not healing so healing beauty aesthetics love all right thank you number one let's get to the next stack of card we're going for those who chose number two let us see what's coming up in your career in the week i feel they're being more grounded you're having quality standard maybe you've decided to give more value to be more precise i feel like it's as if you can't do two things at once is that you're deciding to dedicate yourself to a certain task like commitment being more grounded and stable moving toward your goal aligning i feel like you might be going inside um focusing internally to to connect you with a divine with with something that you want to do i feel to something that is natural to you which is true to you like I, you see we have the okay maybe something religious something that is morally or ethically correct to you that you want to maybe you want to speak truth you want to maybe you want to express yourself you're trying to figure out how to feel valuable enough to express yourself all right let's go we have the seven of swords sword 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 so swords are air signs aquarius gemini libra your career really focus on on what it is that you want to do don't be in and out I feel like there's an advancement there's an opportunity to prove yourself at work and you are going inside to really focus it's like to really align with a set of principles and beliefs and commitment to get you through 
you know as if it takes time for you to really feel this 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 new way of being out maybe you're new to online income <laughs> i feel like that could be it like you're just setting up business online and you have to be dedicated yourself to learn how to really use the computer now you know addressing old belief patterns of i can't do it and, you know trusting having faith that you can learning from others maybe watching what others are doing and using it in your life that's what's going on in your career learning new things the ace of wands I feel like you could be really like quietly passionate about this but you're not maybe you're, you're trying to find balance and certainty in what you're doing maybe you're just going to start something new you have a new idea right I feel like you could have a new idea or you're doing something new creatively something creative for the first time but you have to really reflect on the belief patterns thought patterns that you had previously a new idea coming into you so this is this card represents you getting a new creative idea something productive coming through blessings financial blessings um, something something being fertile or virile as if you have what it takes growth luck fortune magic creative you could be just deciding to try out something new in an area a spiritual spiritual path so look out for new opportunities so this card represents new opportunities coming into you for maybe for you to do something that is natural to you something that you're skilled at okay so look out for new opportunities all right thank you for listening those who chose number two now let's get to our final viewers those who chose stack cards number three let us see number three what's coming up in your career for the week we have the ace of pentacles over here this is some blessings coming in fortune maybe inheritance like you're about to get a lump sum of money maybe who knows where it's coming from but you're about to get some money are you open to receive though you know do are you aware that this is coming into you so look out for those opportunities to receive some financial blessings or you're coming up with another idea that will enable you to make more money it's a gift of financial blessing and inheritance so maybe you're doing something that you're really good at which is you know naturally new and you're starting to earn from it okay so that's the overhead of your reading your message so let's go okay so we have the seven of pentacles pentacles represents money see we have the pentacles card up here seven of pentacles working like uh, contemplating appreciating taking a moment to really look at the things that you have manifested so there's plenty manifestation maybe you have several streams of income and there's more to come I feel like this is when a farmer is standing farmer is standing and look at, looking at his crops of corn and they're flourishing beautiful golden corns on trees and he's proud of himself that it's now harvest time. So yes, I feel it is harvest time for you. Something is coming in for you. So that I did say you're getting a gift, an abundance of blessings and inheritance. So something is coming in, it's harvest time. It's financial harvest time, so look forward to that. Um, I also want to say, excuse me, you know, 
um, be mindful of how you're going to spend this. It just because he's in contemplation mode here, wondering how to really disperse this cash. You know, so be mindful of how you spend. Spend wisely. Make sure you take of what is take care of what is important first. That is the energy I'm feeling because even as a excuse me. Thank you for holding. <laughs> Thanks. Sorry about that. So even as a farmer, one knows that he investments has to go back into his farm into tools materials seeds so it's about thinking carefully and budgeting i feel this money is gonna come to you yes see you're reaping it's amazing those of you who chose number three all right let's see the second card tower the tower card means there's something coming in to an end could be an end you see it's like you're getting an inheritance that will put an end to hard times maybe things that felt detrimental in your life so so I do feel like you're getting a blessing number three a financial blessing coming up that is very that's pretty amazing so there's a blessing coming in for you financial blessing I feel like you'll be happy so thankful like it will be unexpected money really like it's unexpected a check came in unexpectedly and put an end to certain worries that you were you didn't know how you're going to do something I feel like you might have been even crying I know this blessing is just it's amazing coming into you wow okay <laughs> all right so that's all i have for you today thank you so much for tuning in and if you like this video go ahead and give me a beautiful massive thumbs up and consider subscribing to my channel as a show of support and as always thank you so much much love to you